here's the full list of monsters of my Yu-Gi-Oh cards that I would smash. We've got Enchanting Mermaid. Very seductive. We've got Elemental Hero Clayman. Look at that gentle giant energy. Warrior Warrior of Zira. Just so, so jacked. Just Elemental Hero Wildheart. Uh, also very jacked. This is basically Henry Cavill the card, like I said earlier. Musician King. Just a pure... When you just want a pure drug and alcohol fueled smashing and you want to destroy the hotel room and like you f no one pays for it you manage to wheeze your way out of it but man you are not going to be walking straight for the week after Mat Mat mataza the zapper very very loyal very skilled i dig it i would warrior lady of the wasteland let me just let me hey. just not 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 one more for good measure. No. Abso fucking lootly. Gear Freed the Swordmaster. Very, very attractive man. Very attractive. And like, uh. I'm trying to think, who does he remind me of? I don't know. I don't have anyone specific in mind, but man, just look at that hair. Gorgeous. Uh, Dark Hole, because, I mean, just think of the discoveries in physics that you could make if you. A, manage to get in the same room as a black hole, and B, if you bang it. Kaiser Seahorse, because this card is fucking badass, and I love it. <clears throat> and I have no other reason aside from that. Get out of there. Zur, Knight of Dark World, who is a Doctor Doom-esque energy kind of a character that I greatly enjoy. I feel he would be tough but fair. Silent Swordsman level 5. Just fucking, just, just a badass. He's just got a real, like, anime vibe to him. He seems like he'd be the protagonist of an anime, like, and just fucking, just a tank. Just a tank of a man. You're a mermaid. I guess, I, I guess we banging fish. Ooh, Gyakuteno Megami. Hell yeah. Look at those sweet tattoos, the tiara. Great. Fucking great choice, if I do say so myself. Graceful Charity, she's got like a... She's got like a, a quiet MILF energy to her. Dig it. Soul Release. I'll be releasing my nuts into that soul. Don't judge me. DD Warrior Lady. <laughs> Hell yeah, for anyone who likes leather. Magician of Faith, got kind of a studious college girl vibe to her that I, I think really, really works for her, you know? Uh, magic Cylinders, as we've established, there's probably a vacuum there, and you can bang it. Go for the Legend, just absolutely great for splitting me in half. Just, just right down the middle. 2600 attack dark magician he does that attack where he like uses his hand but uh use it on my junk warrior diagrapher uh look at those freaking arms he's even got the oh man he must really practice with the shake weight familiar possessed asa uh got a real real studious velma vibe to her I dig it. It's good. Elemental Hero Burst and Atrix. Nut. Fucking nut. Just, uh, water Amotics. In the Japanese version, this card is more nude, and those arms are... She works out, man. Carrying those jugs of water. Fucking... He is a... I bet she has a great core. Grand Tiki Elder. There may be curses involved, but those are some soft hands. And the masks for if you want to get freaky. Element Soldier. Seems seems very... Uh, 
well-trained, protective, loving, wholehearted, other kind things. And I really love the color of the armor, so. Taihon, it's a hole. That's enough of that. Agent Elf, hell yeah. Got a, got a really interesting style. Uh, nice hair. Got a, got a, got a staff to stick in your butt. Good stuff. Monk fighter. He works hard. He plays hard. He will smash your boulders. Change of heart. A angel in the streets. Fucking demon in the sheets. Uh, guilt. If if a mermaid can get in there, guilt gets in there. Lord of D. This this man got got through purely on his name. I'm not ashamed of that. Neo the Magic Swordsman. He's a handsome guy. Handsome. I would. And he's got a little magic. Who knows what that mag who knows what that magical finger will do? Burst return. Uh I love elements of your persons. <laughs> Thorn Stalker. Uh I want to say it was just a phase in my life at an uncertain time, but I'll, I'll never forget him. Also, he's Jack, Command Knight. Hell yeah. A little bit of control. You know, someone who knows what they want, someone who knows how to command things, and someone who will fucking communicate to you and just... Get down and dirty when they need to. Mystical Elf. Just absolute, absolute classic. Just classic. You cannot, you cannot say no. Uh, Mr. Volcano, he's, <laughs> he's a fiery one. <laughs> but a uh, uh, Malevolent Nuzzler, aka Big Titty Goth GF. I need not explain further and I will not take any additional questions. Dark Witch. She looks like she's ready for a night on the town, and, you know, being prepared, it's good. It's good stuff. A tall cyber. Yeah, she's got grace, she's got beauty, she's got fucking fantastic hair. Who wouldn't? She was she was the popular girl in high school that everyone wanted to get with. Uh, dark assailant. I will not take questions at this time. And Satsu. Uh, quick. Efficient. Discreet. Perfect. Uh, Kagemusha of the Blue Flame fucking fantastic calisthenics works out just all around great body handsome dude fucking hell yeah elemental hero flame wingman I do not care if like if there is no orifices on this thing aside from the dragon head I will find a way to smash it because I love this card judge man you know smashing with justice uh, marauding captain seems loyal seems good in control. Got a weird haircut, but I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. Nano Breaker. I mean, if she's okay with small things, then she will be okay with me. Celtic Guardian. Very handsome elf. Very loyal. Just classic. Same thing as a mystical elf, but in in elf form, I guess. That's weird that they're both elves, actually. It's both different types of elves. VW XYZ Dragon Catapult Cannon. Uh, again, same category as Elemental Hero Flame Wingman. Don't know if you can smash this thing. I will find a way. I'll do it. Luster Dragon number two, because uh, that boy thick, and I like it. And finally, absolute classic... Blue Eyes, White Dragon. If I can get in good with Blue Eyes, I can get in good with Kaiba. And Kaiba will fucking pay me money. And I'll get rich at the end of banging all these cards. I need a new hobby.